in the backyard. I just recorded all of that with no audio. I did get a new mic by the way. I just recorded all that with no audio. Kind of embarrassed. My friends don't even know. Oh my, that was my brother. That's his truck right there. Uh, he just left already, went to go do his taxes. We're gonna see you guys in the morning when there's more daylight. And let's hope I don't forget the audio. Just like that, we are back. It's uh, next day, uh, I got a new haircut. It's currently about like three in the afternoon right now. Car's in the backyard now. Uh, finally, we had some, uh, some unfortunate events happen. I kinda like scraped it against this car and against this uh, go-kart. Uh, nothing too major, but I think birds took a dump of my car. I'll show you right now. So I have no idea what all this is. Uh, I think birds took a dump of my car and someone had mud. I messed up my car, man. Come on. Anyways, we're gonna jack it up from the rear. Uh, the fuel tank is under there. I'm not sure if I can show you that. Put it right behind that bar. That's the fuel tank. That's the fuel tank right there. So we're gonna jack it up and uh, maybe try to start it in a bit. So the problems we're having is fuel. We're not sure if it's um, whether it's uh, the fuel pump itself, which most likely it is. Probably gonna have to replace it. But we also think maybe the lines on this might be clogged or something. So uh, I do have to figure out which lines go to the back. I believe it's this one. This one goes all the way to the back. And gotta check another car. Check it out, maybe uh, blow some compressed air through it. We'll see if I can get a compressor in here.
I might have maxed out the jack already. I'm not sure. Well, we're getting there. All right, so I encountered my first problem, and not sure if I'm gonna be able to get any work done today, mainly because uh, the jack I'm currently using right now, and there's glass everywhere, jack I'm currently using right now is too small. It's, um, it won't lift the car high enough to get these bigger jacks. It's like, these are huge compared to this little one you know these are the the AutoZone specials as I like to call them and I need to get under there to uh, undo the fuel tank but I did find the fuel lines these uh, these three lines the one in the meat and uh, the medium the medium sized one there's three right here the medium sized one is the one that goes to the fuel pressure regulator and then straight to the fuel rail so for right now I think we're gonna call it a done wrap I gotta get the other jack in here and I gotta move some of the stuff that's uh, behind the car so I can get in from the back these bolts right here are really hard to get off they're like covered in this um, I have no idea what it is that I think it's undercoat for the cars my whole car is covered with undercoat and those are going to be really hard to get off so I don't know what I'm going to do about that probably hit it with a hammer break most of that stuff off and uh, we'll see how we get that off so my plan is to uh, remove the fuel lines uh, if I can if I can reach them uh, before I drop the tank I want to remove the fuel lines first and then see if I can blow some air through them if not then found my problem because uh, the problem I was having was I'd put a new fuel pump in and it lasts for a while, but I think it like run lean. I'm all dirty. I was laying on the floor. It would run a bit lean because uh, the fuel pressure wasn't up there. So beautiful day today. I can't stop looking at myself in the viewfinder. But uh, I had replaced the fuel pressure regulator because I, I thought that was the problem. And it's kind of annoying. I had to wait like three days for that to uh, come in from Arizona, I think. Arizona, yeah. So we're not gonna give her the key right now. Uh, probably wait till I uh, do the fuel lines. I don't really wanna start it right now. Uh, I, I have to go charge the battery. Uh, and that should take a while. And sun's going down. Looks like uh, I'm done for today. If you guys like these videos and are interested in seeing this car run soon uh, make sure you guys like subscribe and uh, comment down below some things you like or some things you didn't like uh, let's start a chat see you guys in the next one this is a Brian Little production